I'm Britt from Santa Spines and this is Brian and welcome to our video. So we are at our cottage getaway. We just arrived like five minutes ago and I'd like to show you the place. Um, let's see. This is the front porch. Welcome. We love a good front porch. I got a new broom. Uh, yes, we've been here before, a few times actually. This is our favorite spot. We've got the living room with this ambient music playing. A grand fireplace. I don't know how to turn off the music, so we're just going to be Soundscapes. listening to the soundscape of peace for a while. Got this wooden decor, these cute little folded tissues. Allergy season has kicked me in the face, so definitely gonna be needing those. And the kitchen, right walk this way, right this way. Love the red cabinets. Um, the red Keurig though, like I need a red Keurig for our kitchen. I mean, I don't need it, but it just like would be such a nice it would, accent. It would look perfect in our kitchen. It really would. Um, this whole thing would be nice. Yeah, that whole place. This, I love the table. I mean, for the vibe. Of course, that's where you want. <laughs> uh, out here, we have the hot tub. Let's see if it's locked. Oh, yeah. This is Brian's favorite part. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It looks the same. It does look the same. Ooh, she's sleeping. <laughs> but oh, don't don't look at this. Okay. We brought the food because gotta eat. Gotta eat. And then in here we got guest room. But wait till you see the tree. Got the cute little twine hemp around the curtains and the bathroom, which I think Brian just went in. I did. Why would you? Okay. Well, that's the bathroom. This is a do not enter closet. <laughs> it's a very large bathroom. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Oh, they added this shelf thing. That's cool. Okay. This matches the tissues. The red that matches the kitchen. Yeah, okay. This shelf though. Holy moly. My dad could make something like this. Okay, well, that's it. That's sorry to invade. I'm coming that's to the okay. bathroom now. The whole internet's gonna know that you were gonna go to the bathroom. People do that. People, so people do do that. Okay. Like he is human. Okay. So in conclusion, hello, welcome to the video. This is where we'll be staying, and stay tuned. Now, we are also celebrating something big. Go ahead and tell us what we're celebrating. So. Is this how I want to look for this announcement? Okay, um, I just checked my email and um, I got accepted into grad school. So I will be studying uh, in library and information science this fall uh, online. It's like processing and I'm very excited and wow. It says, congratulations, I'm delighted to officially inform you of your admission to the program. Um, I trust that you will view this offer of admission as recognition of your accomplishments and as a vote of confidence in your potential for success in graduate school. Um, so I just have to accept it and I will be accepting it. So <laughs> thank you to everybody who believed in me and wished me luck, <laughs> especially my mom and you and the people who wrote me recommendation letters as well. <laughs>
<laughs> sorry, sorry. You were you up. Today is Tuesday, it is about 5 p.m. and we have been having a very lovely time 
Brian's out in the hot tub right now, and I told him I was going to record a little vlog segment, so just as a check-in. Um, yeah, yesterday we just kind of like relaxed, we enjoyed the hot tub, made a fire, and then this morning we went on a hike. It was like a, like a six-mile hike. My knees are so sore and my legs are so tired, um, so it was a very long walk. And then when we got back, we kind of like hung out for a little bit, ate lunch, and then walked down to this like pond. There was like a little trail down to like a pond in the sort of backyard forest area of this cottage. So I went down there and we read for a little while. Um, and now we're back here. Now we're gonna start dinner after the hot tub. But I just want to talk about books for a little quick little few minutes. I'm feeling very chaotic in terms of the amount of books I'm reading right now. A couple weeks ago I started uh, How the One-Armed Sister Sweeps Her House by Sherry Jones and about halfway through it I kind of put it down and started a different book because it's just a real downer. It's such a heavy book and it's just very joyless so I just needed a break from it and I started Call Baby by Morgan Jerkins. Kind of like a little bit unsettling, like the topic, like if you know what a call is. Oh, the oven's preheated. Sorry about that. So um, if you know what a call is, it's kind of just like an extra layer of skin that some babies are born with. This one family has call on them as like adults like just as an extra layer of skin and they like sell that to wealthy people who are in need of like healing extra healing properties or whatever so it's very interesting um i'm liking it so far the writing's good the characters are interesting but then i also started no one is talking about this by patricia lockwood which i am currently on page 68 about um, I forgot to say what page I'm on for this. For Call Baby, I'm on page 97, so only about this far. And in No One Is Talking About This, I am yay far. So, kind of got my toe in like three different books right now, but this one's very good uh, so far. It's very, very, very fragmented. Um, a lot of what she's writing about is just like allusions to internet trends or memes so there's a lot of like subtext to this that isn't outright obvious like if you haven't been an active participant of social media and the internet i'm also very tired so i am very very tired yeah that's all just go crazy for it i don't know why oh fun fact i share my birthday with eva longoria
ya! Today is Thursday. We got back from our trip yesterday and I just wanted to close out the vlog. We had a really nice time. Just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. I think my favorite part of our trip was sitting by the pond and reading as well as feeding the fish. Yeah, I did not read much further in any of the books that I discussed, so I'll probably be discussing those books in either future reading vlogs or, um, I don't know, I haven't decided yet what my next video is going to be after this vlog. Um, trying to figure that out for this month, but yeah, I'm really happy to be home. It was a lovely trip. We love staying in that cottage, but um, it's definitely nice to be back home and where it's comfortable and with the cats. Got Karma sleeping here. Juliet over there. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye. See ya.